It's a well-worn stereotype, the donut-loving cop, but a young man who calls himself the Donut Boy is delighting police around the country with that very treat. CTN's Jennifer Anderson met up with him this week in Coon Rapids. Ready, set, go! It might look like kid versus cop. Yeah, yeah, kid. Coon Rapids police officer Brian Platts against the Donut Boy. The feeling has to go down. But really, there are yeah. no sides here. <laughs> On this day, roll call came with laughs and lots of sugar. 11-year-old Florida native Tyler Karach has given out 75,000 donuts to police officers around the country. Awesome. Make that 75,000 and two. His mission to thank every cop in America started after Tyler and his mom had a chance encounter at a store in 2016. I saw some officers or deputies and so I wanted to buy them a snack and thank them. So when I left after thanking them, I said, why were they so happy over a snack and excited? She said it wasn't the snack they were excited about. It was because I took the time to say thank you. After I heard that, I said I wanted to thank every cop in America. In the two and a half years since, with cape in tow, Tyler has traveled to 41 states delivering donuts. Into the slammer. Getting an inside look at law enforcement. And sharing his superpower, <laughs> goodwill. He's uh, a nationwide uh, sensation now, and it's, it's such a good message. And um, you know, for a kid that age to to be to be thinking like that and to appreciate the efforts that that go into this line of work, uh, it's 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 heartwarming. Funded by donations, sponsorships, all y'all get together, and the family's own pocketbook. There you go, that works. Tyler's mom is the great. engine making his donut dream machine run. Now, I never in a million years thought that it would actually turn into everything it has turned into, but it kind of just took off and I just kind of rolled with it and, you know, just kept planning things and planning things as we could. And smile over here, smile over here. To see grown men and women who are touched so much by something as simple as just saying thank you, two simple words that, you know, we all could do more of. And to see this little child being able to do that and put that impact on them is just incredible. Now, back to that donut eating contest. Oh, no! <laughs> Yeah, that one. When a little child's play is this mm -hmm. good for the soul, maybe everyone wins. No! For CTN Update, uh, I'm Jennifer Anderson. Good job. <laughs> On this stop, Dunkin' Donuts provided the treats at half price for Tyler. His efforts just recently became an official nonprofit. If you'd like to contribute, check out his Facebook page, I don't need a reason to thank a cop.